What is up, Captain Sand Cadets? Today I figured I'd give the showroom a little bit of love. We have not been here for a while because we've been concentrating on so much star-based ever since the Surge event ended. Um, so I thought I'd come here and do a little bit of racing, and we are going to go through every single one of the extra extra small ships and the extra small ships. So let's get into it. Let's go. Whoa! What's up, Muds? What's up, Ponies? And what's up, Oosters, man? I wanted to give the showroom a little bit of love right here. And I am in experimental mode. And what I'm going to do is, while I'm in experimental mode, you're able to play this um, one mode right here, which is combat versus bots. And this is basically a race racetrack mode where you actually get to shoot other spawned in players. Um, they are controlled by AI, so um, they're not other players. Um, one day they will be. Um, and I got. I'm kind of inspired just to play the showroom because I've been watching a lot of Wooden Nichols um, footage. Um, he's a uh, X creator and he's been posting a bunch of footage of himself um, playing this mode. So I figured I'd give it a little bit of love. And also this right here, the Ogrika Rook, I've actually never uh, flown that ship before and it's available to fly now. And then the Nurik right here I saw was available to fly in test flight mode. And I've never actually flown that ship either. So um, we get to fly the two, the, the little brother and the big brother there, the two Agricas. Um, but I want to start off with the air bike just to kind of warm up a little bit. Um, if you're new to Star Atlas, the air bike is basically the Harley of the Star Atlas ships. It's one of the extra, extra small ship. It's not too expensive and it's all, it's an all around great ship for the, you know, for fooling around here on the showroom. It just feels nice and, uh, looks awesome. Sounds great. Now, in order to start this mode, you need to find that yellow box right there and you aim right at it. And away we go and I'll spawn in some other ships. We got a Lobi, we got a Nurik right there. We got an Opal Jet Jet I'm racing against. Come back here, suckers. I haven't hit one. I basically just, man, I'm a little rusty. Oh, someone released a bomb. I was, I was reading that, uh, I think it's the R button if you pick up like one of these things right here, like that. So that's like basically like is a trap right there. It's a trap. I'm going to see if I can pick that up. Let's see. And if I hit R, what did I just release? I'm just going to look. Yeah, I think I released that trap right there. So I believe that I just did. So we'll find out. I'll try again. It's hard because I'm using the controller and it doesn't have a designated button for um, the, uh, any of these pickup bombs or anything like that yet for the, the controller. So right here I have a bomb. I'm gonna hit R. Yeah, sweet! Unfortunately I have to use my keyboard and controller at the same time. What is this one? R. Is that just ammo? Go this way to the right. See if we can head cut one of these guys off. Boost, boost. Yeah, I just got in front of one of the dudes. I don't know if that's good or bad. Let's change the mode here. So this is what it looks like when you're, you know, from first person when you're sitting inside the ship. I'll shoot my, my laser so you guys can see. Woo, come here, Lobby. And then this is the side view. This, this one looks great, man. If you're like making videos and you just want it to look kind of sexy, this is the way to go right here. A little disorientating to try to play in this mode this way you know this view but it looks awesome all right next i'm going to grab the visa solos another extra extra small ship right here looking sweet love the paint looks black but when the light hits it it's got that like really nice like iridescent green to it All right, let's enter this baby. Let's see how this thing handles on the track. Now I did notice on that, playing that with that air bike, it did seem like everything was a little bit slower and uh, it was a little easier to control. A little bit of lag, but not too, oh, that guy just turned invisible. I don't know if that's a glitch or what. Let's see if I can take him out. 
while he's invisible. Now the Visa solo, it's, it's a little bit, I don't know why, it's, it's causing a little bit of lag on there. It's just, oh, I'm hitting the trap. Come on, Loby, see you later. These Lobies, man, you'd think who would fly a Loby on a racetrack like this, but uh, it takes a lot of damage to kill these guys. But they got a lot of shield, a lot of health. Trap, trap, trap. It's a trap! Wow, Admiral Akbar! Wow, Admiral Akbar cereal! Good, I'll, I'll take out the Loby while I'm in, he's in the trap. Ah, uh, no more. My lasers are... Flight mode. I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna put it in flight mode and I'm gonna try to set a trap right in front of these guys. Alright, I'm gonna go over here. Hover mode. R. <laughs> it's a trap! <laughs> you have to imagine me with a giant squid head. <laughs> that didn't work near as cool as I thought. Next I'm gonna try this little ruck right here. This is a Grick of Ruck. Uh, Oh my god, look how thin that thing is. Dude, as an ooster, I'm thicker than that thing, I think. <laughs> it's a little thicker than a, than a true, you know, than it looked when I was walking up to Oh my god, this thing's hard to control. Then when I walked up to it, what the heck? The flying blade. It's a flying blade. Let's go. Oh my gosh. This thing's a wild thing, man. Wild thing. I think I love you. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Boom. One guy down. This is a weird engine sound to this thing. It's just like a whoosh, right? It's like you just hear the uh, the air coming by your ooster ears. Come on, baby. A rook taking out his big brother right here, the nerd. Come on, can I get this guy? Now notice this triangle right here. If you hit some of the numbers, like if I hit two right here, it actually supposedly aims the more. So now I have more firepower right now. I don't know if it actually quite does anything, but let's check it out. Where'd that guy go? Right in front of me. The shield's going up, unfortunately. Man, his shield's all the way up. He's toast, but his shield's up. Man, this thing's hard to control my little wild thing. Ah! Off the track. Completely off the track. <laughs> Look what this thing looks like when you're inside of it. How the heck do you see anything? This is a pretty cool angle though. This looks sick from the side view though. Look at this. It's so ridiculous this 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 view right here. Like what the heck? We need a front window for sure. Or like some type of like sensors to tell you there's a ship in front of you. <laughs> I 
All right, next I'm going to do the Calico Scud. This is a really nice looking ship right here. It's pretty big. I think this is, I believe it's an extra small instead of an extra, extra small. And this is a racer, so this is designated just for what we're doing right here. Racing. Oh, this feels nice. This thing's fast. I bought this ship. I, it's really expensive in the marketplace. I got a real, I got a, just a deal on it. I, I happened to buy it at the right time before it really started to go up in price. It was coming down to like, I think I, I got it in maybe uh, $65, maybe, maybe 70, I'm not too sure, but I think it's up to like over a hundred at least. This feels awesome by the way though. It steers nice, maneuvers nice. I like this ship a lot. I'm gonna definitely utilize this once, you know, the, the full on racing comes out. This was definitely like an investment for uh, future use. I'm, oh, <laughs> but I just got creamed. All right, next I think I'm gonna grab a Pierce X4. This was one of the only ships that was, um, you know, had its full skin in the last version of the showroom, so. I feel like not a lot of people utilize this one because they used, used it so much during the first version of the showroom. This is a sweet ship, man. This is the Council of Peace, one of the Council of Peace ships, I believe. So this would be basically a cop bike. It's got a cop motor, a 440 cubic inch plant. It's got cop tires, cop suspension, cop shocks. It was a model made before catalytic converters, so it'll run good on regular gas policeman's bike. This actually has some decent storage too in it for playing in Starbase. Just a little extra compared to the other extra extra small ships. Doing some damage too. So this is the view inside, you know, from first person. And this is the third view. Instead of like, kind of like an up close side view, it's a, it's a little bit of a distanced side view. It's kind of a unique uh, third view on this one. I like the jets coming off the bottom bottom of this thing. That's cool looking. This is hard to control for some reason for me though in this view. Yeah, I like its boost, man. I want to do that again. Hold on. How can you tell when the boost is ready? Right now? Yeah, boosh. All right, so Eli wants to get on this, and he's going to try his luck at racing a couple of these ships yeah. right here. I just have to shoot for extra ships in the sky. <laughs> Just in case, right? Yeah, just in case. All right, so we have a couple on here that you haven't tried, but it's up to you. You can choose pretty much. Um, the let's see, I'll do the only own first. The Griga Brunch. The Griga Rook. So you have that one, and there's actually it's Big Daddy or older brother, I should say, is where is it? It's here somewhere. Oh, right there. 
the Ogrika Nerik. So that it's one. a Nerik or the Rook. The Rook is this tiny little blade, and this one you kind of sit inside of. You want this, this one? one? This one. This right, one. It, it looks really, really... It's actually really a pretty cool ship. I've only flown it one time. I don't think I've ever made a video of it. Well, we need to. Fancy. We'll this go back to the original head. style of your videos of just, hey, look at this ship I got. <laughs> <laughs> so this this is a Puna built. You know those like little raccoon guys? Yeah. It's like one of those type of ships. <laughs> All right. Okay, we're going. As soon as you hit that yellow, it's going to spawn in some more ships, and then you can shoot at those guys, or you can just try racing them. It's up to you. Look at how smooth this is. Yeah, it is a pretty smooth ship. Oh, my goodness. This is like Fortnite now. <laughs> There's a brand new update to Fortnite. Whoa, jeez. How did you just get that hop that high? <laughs> I think I just found a new speedrunning strat. <laughs> There's a new update in Fortnite. It's pretty much all... Uh, it's well, just, it's it's just all Rocket League. It's yeah. just Rocket League. It's pretty cool, though. Have you tried the boost yet? Uh, you press down that left trigger. We're using the Xbox controller like we usually do. Oh, oh geez. What is going whoa, on? Oh, you're standing on your nose. <laughs> Are you still completely upside, upside down? down. <laughs> oh, jeez. Um, can I just skip? You, yeah, you want to cheat? Oh my gosh, you want to make <laughs> Let's cheat, baby. We're cheaters, and we're not <laughs> proud of that. Kids, don't be cheaters. Wait, I want to see if I can replicate that flying thing that I did. Okay, so I think what you do is you go full speed into this wall, and you go like Ooh, that. Ooh, yeah, that's pretty cool. At this point, I'm in dead last. There's no point winning. Also, did they make the UI? Yeah, they're going backwards. Yeah. So I think what you have to do is... Can, can you jump? Oh, oops. So you want to go? How did I do that? We're going to have to look at the footage in, in slow motion. <laughs> Play it right here. I was just noticing how the, atm the atmospheric... It's like one of those cloudy days, but it's still sunny out here. And on the racetrack and uh it's the type of day you get still get sunburned if you don't if you're not careful right yeah oh there's the sun whoa oh there's the corner of the map whoa i, I am not in control of my ship anymore <laughs> wait what's that in the what's that in the horizon I don't what's know. that in beyond the horizon it's beyond the horizon oh that was cool inside the ship uh wait how do you get into hover mode again oh flight mode uh flight mode oh boy okay i got in flight mode you accidentally got revolved the ui though uh I wonder what this is. I don't know. Flight mode. Is this some secret ancient lore? Oh jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I always break Star Atlas? Oh, in. All right. oh that was cool. Well, I'm I'm done breaking this. All right. Let's look at let's Flight see mode. what it looks like inside the ship. Yeah. Let's see if you can find the. Uh... Look at the little figurine on there. I know. All right. Let's see if you can find the bad guys. Oh, turn around. <laughs> yeah, I think we might have to restart. I can see them on the map. Uh, oh, did you just get hit? Pro tip for all the Star Atlas people. Uh, sometimes you don't, when you, for like races, you don't even really want to look at your actual map. You can look at the mini map and that's actually really useful for I always forget about flying. the mini map. That's actually a good point. Because sometimes it can make it way Hello. easier to digest. I'm going to change view again. Ready? Uh, yeah, I'm just. Oh, that's a cool view right there. It's actually kind of cool. The side camera. Ah. Uh, I wish I... Hey, Star Atlas team, I know you have a lot, but could, it would be really cool if you added a drifting feature where you could, like, drift with your ship. That would be cool, too. Like, you could, like, drift or something, like, like up here. you'd have to have side jets on the... You know what I mean? Yeah, like... Yeah. This is the best view, though. Yeah, this is definitely the best view. Oh, that guy's on fire. Get him. Well, I mean, I think it's a little broken that I can just go into fly mode and go. Oh, I'm ahead of you, guys. Ah, oh, you put him back into flight mode. <laughs> Get that guy. Uh, I'm so, I'm so close. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Star Atlas map. What is going on? I'm getting ahead. Of what is that? <laughs> so there's three missiles. I haven't figured out how to shoot them yet with the... Wait, why am I shooting two bullets? Oh my god. Oh wait, what the heck? <laughs> <How did you? laughs> the guy, you got this guy. You got that. That's an opal jet. You got that guy. My, um, it's actually one of your favorite ones to fly. Smooth. What? Oh. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
All right, so you're gonna choose a different ship. What are you gonna choose this time? Wait, okay, I have a question. Mm -hmm. Can I pick any ship that I want that we can own? Um, only the ones that fit on this racetrack. So it's pretty much uh, all, all the ones these. have a check mark. Or? Yeah, pretty much everything that you see right here. Okay, what if I get this one? I want to try this one. <laughs> this it... is, I played this one the other day, actually. <laughs> the bumblebee. No, just car. I just want to use a car. I know. I don't. This one's not. This one actually, they they just about finished, but I don't think it's uploaded yet. So right now it looks really weird because I don't think the tires spin yet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it looks sweet though. Um, that's a really close. Break. I yeah, feels look like at a... the tires aren't spinning, so it's really <laughs> awkward looking. <laughs> I feel like I'm in a Hot Wheel. No, can I please? Bow, bow, bow. <laughs> I can't stop going forward. <laughs> oh no. Uh... Look on the bright side of this. At least we'll be able to capture capture an archive this stuff. <laughs> yeah, this... <laughs> they, I mean, it's literally, they just posted that they finished it, and it looks awesome. Also, why, the sound's muted, I think. Is it? Oh, there no. We go. Oh my god, I'm, I'm- oh. Are you really slow? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I shouldn't be moving at all. These tires aren't spinning. I'm defying yeah. the laws of physics. <laughs> what if you go into- what if you go into flight mode? Wait, can you fly? <laughs> <laughs> well, the tires are supposed to oscillate down so it doesn't look as wonky. <laughs> it's a flying car. <laughs> oh my god, what the heck? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> ah, jeez. Ah, oh. Wait, I just want to say one thing. Off-road, baby. I like how it's labeled as hover mode when you're just driving on yeah. the ground. <laughs> Can you not fix that? <laughs> well, no, because I think that that's what this thing will... All the other ships will be kind of like hovering just off the ground. But, you know, this one will actually be driving once it's like fully implemented. Yeah. Okay, let's try a different one. But... Right. <laughs> <laughs> Unibomber. Unibomber. So, all right. <laughs> sounds like some really weird pop singer. Unibomber. <laughs> Sounds like a terrorist. <laughs> <laughs> Can you look with the mouse quickly? Oh, sorry. All right, here we go. Um, this thing's ridiculous. Oh, I thought it you looks were, awesome. I, it the sit icon's in the bay, so I thought we were gonna just sit in the the like pod thingy. How's it feel in the racetrack so far? Well, uh, I guess you haven't really started. Slow. But... <laughs> oh yeah, you just ran. Right How is this here. only seventy-seven miles? <laughs> How is this? I was at ninety-four. I was at one hundred and twenty-eight before, and I was going slow. What is going on at this point? Oh, get this guy! Can you bomb him with your uni bomber? Oh my gosh, you're annihilating him! Oh my gosh, you—you you almost had him. He, except he disappeared. Oh, oh my gosh! They're in invisibility mode apparently. Luckily, the particle effects still show up. That's actually a pretty cool game design feature. Even if you go invisible, you can still see them. It's just yeah. harder. Like Minecraft where there's particle Ooh. effects. I'm just cheating and I don't care at this point. They're bots. It's not some tournament to win 100 grand. I want to see charity. blow that guy up. Lean weight. What was that? I don't know. Oh, I think that's like when they look uh, It's that like, see that uh, snow thing? It's like almost like a trap. You lay a tra it's a trap. It's a trap. I feel like that YouTuber that we watched that uh, just breaks oh, games. Oh, get this guy. There's a guy. There's a guy. Blow him. Yeah, I know, that guy that breaks you. Why do they keep turning invisible? How does he have so much invisible stuff? Is this gonna be like the first Mario Kart where everything's like, they just <laughs> get like unlimited speed boosts or something? <laughs> it looks cool when he's like, invisible. It looks like there's flying orbs. Like some I magic got, flying yeah. orbs in them. Some cyborg on a if giant you can blow this missile. Guy up while he's invisible, that would be awesome. Can I get ice cream? Hey, that guy was cheating. <laughs> We're all cheating at this <laughs> point. It, what does it look like when you change views on the bumblebee? The bumblebee? Yeah, it's like you're flying a big fat bumblebee. A bumblebee's a bomber? Yeah. I mean, I guess so. They're, okay, so they're... this is what's inside. Wait, why is my head turning like that? Well, did you see that? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, it's in balancing on the bumblebee. On the back of the bumblebee. Alright, this is the. Oh, that's a cool view. Yeah, wait, what, is this what I look like when I'm turning? Yeah. Okay. Alright, let one of those guys catch up for a second and snipe him. Okay. Can we get into a better view? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Oh, oh, jeez. You let one of them pass uh, us. Wait, look at the mini map. Oh. The mini map. Oh, uh, turn, turn, turn. Look at Why is his hands like? <laughs> I don't keep know. dabbing. He <laughs> <laughs> uh, got this guy. He's, he's he got a shield. He's tough. This guy's tough. Even when it gets the game is a little slower, it's kind of nice because I, then I can um catch up hit a little him bit. better. Yeah. Ow. Sometimes I wish when you went to hover mode, you just fell to the ground <laughs> and went in like a million. Let's see this. Oh my gosh. I think this awesome. is gonna be really with fast. That with that tail, it's like... Oh, I'm in hover mode, so it shouldn't touch the ground any second now. Any second now. Alright, 
Next, I think we'll grab a lobe. A low rider. Look at this thing. Can't believe I'm gonna put this thing on a racetrack though. Maybe like a you know drag racing or something like that, but this style racetrack. Hey, the animation for the door was gone. Oh, All right, here we go. Looks awesome though. What a cool ship. Oh my gosh, I'm in first place. <laughs> well, almost first place. Oh, this thing's. Whoa, look at my laser. What? Okay, so wait, is the lobby awesome in this race mode? I thought this thing was gonna be a dog, dude. What the heck? Everyone turned invisible. See you later. <laughs> Ooh, look at this boost. <laughs> oh no! Uh, F one, by the way, brings you back to uh, to the beginning. Respawns your character. I gotta get a little more lobby action, man. All right, kicking the low rider. Oh, my door stuck open? What a ghetto piece of junk. Woo! Except it's fast. Why is my door stuck open? Dude, you just sizzle these guys. You sear them. It's a, it's a trap! Oh, a subterfuge! No! A confining device! A snare! A box popped up with a stick! It's a trap! It's a wrap! Where's my hat? It's a trap! Sorry! Sorry! Just finally figured it out! On my way back to the office! Couldn't get it out of my head! Gotta go! Alright, so this is inside the lobby. Alright, this is inside the lobby and it actually looks like I'm like literally driving a car. <laughs> Say hello to my bucket. It's a bucket, man. Alright, side view action, man. Let's cut this guy off. We're gonna go do a little off-roading. All right, the Pierce X5. Now, I didn't think the lobby was gonna, you know, do anything on the racetrack, so let's see what, I feel like this thing's too big. I played this once before on the racetrack and it didn't go so well, so let's see how this one handles. It actually looks like they added a little bit more to it than the last time I played. It's got its boosters now. It's got a little bit of color to it. Look how big I am compared to everyone. <laughs> oh. I'm too big to even aim. They have to be like in front of me. Like quite a bit in front of me just to see him. Die, nerd. Hey guys. Oh, I just cut the nerd. There's its boost. All right, so this is actually, this is almost easier to steer I'm inside the ship. This is the way to go on this one, I feel like. Oh my gosh, look at the underside of that lobby right here. It's 
So I have the target on the lobby, that's why it's in my right. See if I can catch up to him. Last one. Yes! So you don't have to be fast on the racetrack if you just blow everyone up, right? You're gonna be first place automatically. Oh, there's only one more ship left. I literally might just win this by everyone just blowing up. Who is it? Oh, it's a little air bike. <laughs> Every ship's blown up. So far, the best I did, which who would have thought, who would have thunk it, is a Pierce X5. All right, next I got the Opal Jet Jet. It is the yacht. The yachts of all the, <laughs> of all the small racing ships. A little boat right here, man. This thing flies real nice, actually. Take out the other. Oh, it's a trap. That's a trap! Look, it flies like... It flies wonky. They really... It really feels like a... Like a fish. I hope we have radios in the... Like, I feel like I should be uh, listening to some yacht rock right now. You guys know what yacht, yacht rock is? It's like rich person's easy listening rock music. A little Hall & Oates action there. Ah! All right, inside the Opal Jet Jet. Third alternate view of the Opal Opal Jet Jet. Kind of hard to steer in this view. Looks cool, but hard to steer. All right, now the Opal Jet, the regular Opal Jet. We just did the Opal Jet Jet. This is the Opal a Jet. This is a pretty cool ship because the cockpit, like the way you sit on the very in the front of it, it's like really unique looking. A little pod racer-ish, you know? And it's got some cool sound effects too. There we go. I love this ship. It's kind of saving this for last because I love this ship so much. It's smooth, it's fast. It's a trap! It's a trap! Ah! Oh. oh no. This is inside of the ship. There's no real obstructions on this ship. It's really nice to, you know, sit inside. You know, you're that that cockpit's like right at the very front of this ship, so. You just have those little protection wings or whatever they are, like in front of you. Oh my gosh, alternative views whacked. What is up with this? Uh Alright, gotta get out of that view. <laughs> Let me try that again. One, two. Oh, that's not good. Alright, so don't use the third view of uh the opal jet. Cheat cheat. That was the boost. All right, guys, man, if you like this video, please hit that like button. That helps me out a ton. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe so you get notifications when I put out new videos. If you want to save 10% off from anything from the Automata store, you can use my Star Path link that is down below. Um, it helps out my channel also. And I think you guys are all fantastic. And I'll see you in the next one. Later. Wow. It's a trap. <laughs> It's a trap! <laughs>